Hi, in this video tutorial, we're going to show you how to embed Stripe V2 checkout, which is the new Stripe checkout, onto your Webflow website. The legacy Stripe checkout or V1 Stripe checkout popped up on the website, and the newer Stripe checkout redirects to checkout.stripe.com. We have both, and this video is on V2. So we have two buttons on this page. The top one is the styling that comes right out of Stripe, this purple and white button, and the bottom one is a Webflow button that you can style however you want. We just turned it green, but uh, once it's embedded, you can do whatever you want for styling. So let me click on the top button and show you that it redirects to checkout.stripe.com for payment, and the same thing will happen with your, with your Webflow button. If clicked, there we go. So the other thing I want to show you is how to redirect people after payment to any page, like a success page. Typically that says, congratulations with next steps. So let me fill this out and show you how that works. And your customer will click subscribe and then Stripe will process that payment. And then you will be or the customer will be redirected to whatever URL you have provided. And this is all in a low code slash no code environment where we write the code for you you can just copy and paste. So here we are on our Webflow site to our success kind of thank you page. And let me show you how you would do this yourself. So first step would be to create a page. So Okay, so we're creating a blank page. I also have a page that I've already created that is the, just the success page, which is just a container with a headline and some lorem ipsum. And that page has a URL that you can look up here. The slug is success. And here's the um, URL. It's just our website slash success. OK, that'll be important later on. So let's see, where are we? We're going to go to page 10. OK, so let us embed a container for the button number one. And while I'm there, let me embed the container for button number two, and just separate them. Okay, so the first button will just be embed code. So let's go to Paid Members app and choose Checkout button, which is this V2, this bottom button, rather than the one that pops up like this. So Checkout button, and I'm gonna choose one of my plans that I like. We pull all your plans from Stripe once you connect your Stripe account. Okay, where would you like your users to be redirected after their purchase? Well, I'm going to redirect them to my success page. So I go there, make sure I have the URL correct, and I just paste that in. Okay, so just click Create Button Code, and we will write the code for you. You copy that code and go into your Webflow site and click on Plus there. And then for this, we're going to click on Components and drag in Embed Code and paste in that code. Save it. Okay, that's done. We'll see it on the public site. And now let's burn do the other button, which is our uh, normal button, our Webflow button. So click on basic and drag in a button. Okay, I like this to be centered. Okay, and then you can type in whatever text you want. So we'll say subscribe. And again, you can design this however you want. Let me just, for this example, color this uh, in that purple. That seems fine to me. And the most important thing here is to click on it and over here click the gear icon and give it an ID. You have to give it a unique ID for this page. I'm just going to do 4242 as the unique ID. Okay, so then go to Paid Members app and you can click back. We save your button. So if you don't see it populated, you can, whoops, click on that and that will pre-populate all your saved things. So we already have the success page in the plan. Just click advanced options, use my Webflow button, and then we just ask you for the ID. So just make sure that the ID here matches exactly the ID that you pasted into Webflow. Click create button code, copy the code, and go back to your Webflow site. Okay, so plus, and we are going to take that embed code Drag that in, paste, save, and close. All right, so let's publish this and see what we got. All right, there we are with our two buttons. And the top one, if I click on it, will go here. And the bottom one, if I click on it, will go to the same place. So checkout.stripe.com for payment. So let us show you how we get redirected. 
and your customer will click subscribe the payment will be processed and they will be redirected to your success page there you are congratulations that is how you create v2 the new stripe checkout buttons and embed them into your webflow website